Welcome. In this tutorial, we'll look at Vintage Chorus. With this plugin, you can add, as others have put it, the source to your music. On the most basic level, a chorus is a delay effect that smoothly modulates between two delay times using an LFO, creating pitch and timing variations. Vintage Chorus specifically is an emulation of the chorus processor in a Juno 6. Yes, we did take one apart and hooked all sorts of bids and bobs up to it to see what makes it tick. I know what you're thinking. We promise it still works. I'm sure you've seen emulations of this chorus around the internet. The hardware has two obvious modes with preset parameters that are selectable with a button. You can select the third one by clicking both buttons at the same time. Hold Shift to activate 1 plus 2 mode. Instant Retrowave. Additionally, Vintage Chorus has an edit button. This enables the delays and modulation panels, as well as some of the functions in the Levels panel. For example, the Mix Slider and the Invert Wet function. You can set all the parameters that are accessible under the hood here. As we mentioned earlier, the delay time will modulate between two delay times. So these two sliders, Delay 1 and 2, will set your modulation range. You can also set how much of the output is fed back into the delay's input here. There's a high pass filter for the feedback, so you can make the chorusing effect high frequencies more than low. In the modulation panel, there are controls for the low frequency oscillator, moving the delay between the two specified delay times. You can set its shape and starting phase, and also introduce a phase offset for left and right channels to further increase stereo width. The most obvious controls here are speed and tempo sync. You can synchronize the LFO to FL Studio's BPM or keep it unsynchronized. When synced, the speed slider will snap to steps. And that's all you really need to know about Vintage Chorus to get started. Don't forget to check out the video information for all the demo projects used in this video.